Hello everybody and welcome back to Clive Barker's Undying. Last time we made our way to this broken down old monastery and uh, Elizabeth's been, been hounding us a bit here and there. Not just with her hounds, but with herself. Looks like we actually may have a little shortcut here that we can just like drop down and get out of here. Um, I think that we've, we've done a pretty good job, pretty good job of exploring this area. So let's do that. Yeah, and this brings us right back to the entrance. So uh, I, I don't know. I guess we can do a quick little loop. I don't know if we went all the way over here or not, actually, to some of this other stuff. Because we kind of ran around in there for a while, now that I think about it. So let's just take a quick look. Who dares enter my realm uninvited? <laughs> what do you think of that? Oh, <laughs> she's firing back. They're really getting a lot of mileage after, out, of, out of that laugh track, huh? All right, I guess she's out of here. Um, well, I guess it's a good thing we came over this way so we could at least see that cutscene. Hmm, a little grating on there. So we have dynamite now. We know what we need to do with it, but... Uh, it's entirely... Oh, come on now. Enough of your nonsense, lady. Maybe do a little scry on, uh... On this area. Uh, anyway, yeah, we know what we need to do with it. Um, but we should just take a quick look around. Real quick, we could actually even try it... Right there. Now, is this dynamite like a weapon weapon? Or is it an item weapon? It appears like it's going to be... There we go. It's going to be one of these. I just want to see. Okay. So we'll probably want to save, uh, save those dynamites. <laughs> As best we can, because who knows how many of those we'll actually get. Or what happens if we run out. Won't budge. Can't get in that way. Um, but there might be another way we could go over here. No, we already did that. Yeah, we got the, uh, the amplifier over there last time. So I guess it's really kind of just this part of the building over here. And it doesn't really seem like there's anything over here, so... Uh, I guess we're kind of done. Unless we can get into that tower there. Which seems sort of unlikely. I don't see any door <laughs> to get in here, so... And there's nothing that looks particularly cracked. On this, the side of this thing? I mean, it all kind of looks cracked to me, but... Uh, yeah, I don't know. I guess, uh... We'll try a dynamite just for fun, and then we'll get the heck out of here. Oh, we actually already had it equipped. Where is... There it is. Oops, that didn't go very far, did it? <laughs> does make quite a boom. I guess it just drops it at our feet. Yeah. So, as expected, nothing uh, terribly interesting going on there. So, let's get out of here. Unless, uh, I guess we could try this, too. Jammed. Haven't tried blowing up doors yet. Alright. So, we know where we need to use this. I haven't seen anywhere else obvious to, uh, to drop this, so... We will... Give it a try. I guess it was maybe here too. This little nook. It's a little suspicious. But, uh, nope, nothing there. Alright. Fair enough. I 
how many enemies are going to be waiting for us when we get out here? That's the question. Let's look at the ghost of the monks, ghosts of the monks out here. Evening, fellas. So I think the spot was back down this way. If I'm uh, recalling correctly, basically right down, uh, right down here somewhere, I thought. Uh, maybe, yeah, a little bit farther down. Down to here, yeah, okay. Just double check. I don't see anything else, so here we go. Let's crack this baby open. Right, where the crap are we now? Let's get the dynamite out of here. And we, you know, we have we have a lot of ether, or not ether traps, uh, amplifiers. I'm starting to think that maybe we have enough to start using some. Got the bats coming out. Let's just check for ghosts. Do not see much of anything. Um, oh. Don't mind if I do. It's very useful, thank you. Won't budge. Okay, I guess we're not going that way, at least not yet. What about here? I hear something for sure. Aha. Oh, it's just a uh, just a monk. What is he doing though? Better if we uh, have this out. If we're going to do this song and dance. Well, budge. What do you mean the door won't open? It's literally... Whatever. <laughs> Come on now. I'm just following this guy to see if he goes anywhere particularly interesting. No, I think he's maybe just going to go on a big square. I don't know, we can follow him for a little while longer and just retrace our steps. Can't interact with those torches at all, it seems like. We better save here a little bit. Ooh, that one does open. Okay, that's interesting. I will come back to that. I think he's just going in a big circle, though. It looks like. This is where we. Yeah, this is where we came in. All right. So he's he's got nothing Jammed. interesting for us. It kind of seems like there's <gasps> something behind there. Definitely is. I think we better get a gun out. Um. There's not really anything going on in here. I mean, can the dynamite blow these boxes open? Probably not. I can definitely blow the body up, but um, yeah, I don't think we need to worry so much about that at the moment. Uh, we could try uh, the dynamite on this though, I guess. Nope. There's definitely something back there, though, so um, we'll have to see if we can figure that out at some point before we're done here. I don't know if any of these are going to be particularly suspicious. I'm not even sure what I'm looking at here on the seal. Oh, well, it's upside down, I think. There we go. Not Still not really clear what's uh, going on here, but... Get 
this spell ready, I guess. Some of these guys actually look like a little bit bigger than the others. Which is kind of interesting. Like, he's, this guy's a, clearly a different color. And it seems like he is a bit bigger. How do you like them moves? You're not the only one who can jump around. Oh, still got hit. <laughs> not going very well at all. I think I did get him though. Okay, well there's one. <laughs> okay. Whew. I'll probably cut some of those attempts out. I was just, I don't know, just taking damage over and over. <laughs> from like really easy hits. I'm not sure what the problem was there, but uh, anyway. Uh, or maybe I'll leave those in, who, who knows? It's not that big a deal, I guess, but uh, anyway. Finally took care of these guys. So it seems like these guys are Trisanti. So are the Trisanti like the descendants of the monks? Maybe, I could be. Very interesting uh, soundscape type of situation we have there. There's a ladder here that we could have gone up instead. Though. I guess it's just to spook you a little bit. Because there's nothing going on up here <laughs> whatsoever as far as I can tell. Oh, no, no, there, there is something up there. Never mind. A little hard to see, but, uh, yeah, if we go across this way, there's a body here. But not anything we can do with it, apparently. Okay. You can definitely hear something down there. Uh... Is there anywhere else that we wanted to go down there? I don't, I don't know. Sounds like they're giving me a hint here. There we go. We'll give the bullets to that one. Anybody else? Won't budge. The wall looks a little bit. I don't know. I don't know maybe a little bit suspicious. Hello there. Uh oh. Oh, there he is. I was going to say, I know there's another one around here somewhere. I heard him. <laughs> Just uh, the one blast for that guy. Whoop. There we are. Anybody else coming out of the woodwork? I think we might be okay. At least for a sec here. I think I can dodge these guys okay still. A little easier like this though. There we are. Maybe we do um, some bullets for this other guy. Okay, there's another one. Okay. Are there more? Yes, there are. Oh, shit. Hang on. I 
I see that these guys keep coming. Alright, a little bit of damage there, it's fine. Anybody else? Yeah? These guys are just going to keep respawning forever. Kind of seems that way. There's definitely an amplifier around here somewhere. I can hear it. We'll have to come back and look for that. It does really seem like these guys are going to infinitely respawn, though. Alright, what do we got here? Something, something, something. Be ever vigilant or the undying king will walk the earth once again. Something, something, something. Alright, we stop the onslaught temporarily here. Doesn't seem like it. Alright, we gotta see about this amplifier situation here. There's an awful lot of ammo on dogs that keep coming. What? Really? <laughs> Alright. Fine. I guess. Aha! What have we here? Ah, and this drops down into here. Okay, I gotcha. Okay, that opens. Um, ah, chest we got some bullets out of. That's useful. Oh, there's a lot of guys there. <laughs> Probably gonna need to reload that one. Hmm. Have a little trouble here. Let's try this. Just one barrel at a time and get this out. All of those, all of these shots are missing somehow. Oh my friggin' <laughs> It's so annoying. Okay, it's fine. Save the game. Won't budge. No, that one doesn't open, it's this other one over here. We get the uh, get the gun out. Try this instead. Okay, I guess that works. <laughs> Moving right along. Guys just keep on coming forever. It's very annoying. <laughs> I think we I think we just gotta get out of here. Alrighty, so the uh, <laughs> game crashed a little bit there. I'm not sure how much footage I'm gonna still have of what was going on, but basically these guys keep spawning forever. It's very annoying. And, um, we're going to try and just do what we can here, I guess. I don't know if there's anything actually in here or not. Okay, let's uh, see if we can get a sec here to just look. 
I don't see anything in here really, so let's move on. You can see there's already another guy spawning here. Might be better off just running away from everything. What the fuck is that sound? <laughs> I don't know. Look, whatever, man. <laughs> We're out of there. Won't budge. Can't go back. Uh, and it's probably for the best, because we wasted so much ammo in that area. Probably gonna cut out, like, a lot of the struggle, just to keep things, you know, Stop. keep things moving. But, um, yeah, that was, that was very obnoxious, to say the least. Alright, let's try, um... Actually, I was going to say maybe try some silver bullets, but we don't have that many. So I guess let's not do that. And instead... Okay, there's one guy. There's two guys. Well, that was unusually easy. <laughs> but I'll take it, I guess. Okay, this just loads into a totally different area all of a sudden. Is that desirable? I don't know. So we'll take a look real quick, since we're right here. Um, can I get up there? Yes, maybe? A little jumping? Seems like we're back outside the, uh, the monastery area. Got this guy. Oh, there you are. Okay. Don't tell me they're just gonna always respawn forever now. We do not have the ammo for this bullshit. Woo! Spicy. Yeah, I think they might just respawn forever now. Excuse me? <laughs> what the fuck is that? This game's getting getting mean all of a sudden. Let's go back and we'll try it again. I have no idea if this is the way we actually want to go or not. Alright, we'll drop a save. And uh, I guess we'll just have to be aggressive with our movement from now on and um, ignore the enemies as best we can. If I can even freaking get up here, jeez. Having some <laughs> having some difficulty this episode for whatever reason. All right. I see ya. I definitely got him in the face. Okay, fair enough. Okay, well, it does help, I find, if you don't walk directly into the enemies. Probably, probably a good idea to avoid doing that when possible. Dude, as soon as one dies, there's another one to replace him. Like, instantaneous respawns here. Okay, I see a skeleton. Looks like we got a big dog there. Is there anything in here worth getting? There is. Okay, so we have to... We have to go this way. But we don't have to fight these guys, necessarily. So here's what we'll do. Let's get the shotgun out, because it'll probably... Eh, it'll probably make our life a little easier. Um... Did I actually get the health from that last thing? I feel like maybe... Oh, no, here we go. Yeah, there we go. All right. Let's... Yeah, we'll get the shotgun out. It'll probably make life a little bit easier. I'm going to save as soon as I get... up to uh, here, so I don't have to redo this platforming. Okay, here we go. you got to just run fast, I think, is the uh, the name of the game here. Hello, good day, sir. Goodbye. Kill the one, maybe. Nope. 
Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give the shit! Alright, who's left? Just keep on running. Oh, there's any reason to dilly-dally down here? Take her... our spoils and get the fuck out. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. What did I get? I, uh, I'm actually not even sure. Got the silver something other? Time incantation. Right, so we needed that. For sure. And we got some, some kind of a key, it looks like. Uh, and then some kind of a journal entry? The Abbot's Journal? Um... Yeah... Da, da, da. Uh, okay, well, this actually might be important. Alright, may the ears of the future forgive me. Uh, demons move among us, and regrettably, I know I'm responsible. I've sacrificed the trust of my brothers in hopes of ridding the world of a great evil. The consequences are greater than the cost. Even now, I hear my brother's screams of anguish, but I cannot save them. I leave this testament to future, uh, to a future hope. Perhaps an emissary will find this incantation and undo that which has been done. Find the elements of moon and sun and stand before the mirror of time. Call upon the lords of day and night and invoke the incantation that blurs the laws of time. Stop the demons from stealing the scythe of the Celt. In the wrong hands, this powerful artifact has the ability to unravel the soul. The weapon is forged from chaos and has been our undoing since per per uh, Preservus, Kellis Constantine, Ever Vigilant Brotherhood of St. George. Okay. So that seems like... Whoop. Apparently I was facing the wrong way there. Um, seems like... That, uh, yeah. Those are instructions for what we got to do with the incantation we just picked up. Okay, I see you. Oh, you're not dead. Okay. I would like to explore more, but with all this bullshit going on, it's kind of tricky. Jesus Christ! Oh, it's you. Uh, you know, we could try something here. No, no such luck. It was... Oh, no, that's, that's the wrong spell. Uh, this. This spell. Good day, sir. Become erased? <laughs> I'd wondered, uh, if that might work. Because it kills them when they're down, but uh, I never tried it when they're still up. So that would make things a little faster, potentially. But it does cost an awful lot of mana to do that. We definitely hear more of them. Okay. Let's just erase one immediately, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of guys. Some might argue that's too many guys. <laughs> Legend has it, that's too many goddamn guys. Okay, we can almost do one of these. Get him out of here. How fast are they? Are they fast enough to catch me if I do this? Okay, silver key. Seems promising, but I don't really want to do that yet, I don't think. Because we can't go back, so I'd like to explore a little bit more. So let's try this. Um, we'll just be quick. Get the gun out, maybe. Okay, so that's all caved in. Stuck. Stuck. Okay, that actually opens. I can't see anything. A little more dynamite. And uh, in, HP, in theory, an HP pack that's probably not worth picking up. I think we can try that again. Just uh, come down here. We know we want to go in there. Grab these, grab that before this guy gets up. Go this way. Nothing in there. Silver key. And we're out of there. Having to, like, implement the almost halfway speedrun strats to get through the game at this point. It's getting a little getting a little wild, and I, don't, and I really don't think that the amplifier stones are going to make any difference when it comes to just all the absolute bullshit that we've seen in this in this section of the game. I don't like that you're down here. 
get out of here. That's right. Okay. What, uh, what fresh nonsense is in store for us now? Hello. I mean, eh. I did ask. Okay. I would accept some additional ammunition at any point, really. Okay. Oh, yeah, they are biting you, you little bastards. <laughs> um, Alright, looks like we got... Oh, spoke too soon, maybe. I say maybe we got a sec. Nope, we don't. I'm not wasting shotgun shells on, on bats. There you go. Do a little Tibetan war cannon. Uh, no, I wanted to come over here and try... Uh... We've been getting all this dynamite, so... That wasn't a very good placement. No. Okay. Well, I figured it was worth a try, at least. I'm sure, I imagine there must be something, like, that could be dynamited around here. But, uh, I'm not sure what exactly. It's a little, uh, a little dark here. Um, okay. Do we want to go that way? I guess we can... Oh, okay. So we wonder if the silver bullets might be better to use on the purple guys. Oh, shit. Maybe the silver bullets would be better on the purple guys, because they seem to be a little bit tougher. Whereas the uh, the other ones kind of potentially die up up to one one or two hits sometimes. Phosphorus shells. Oh, that's interesting. Because, uh, yeah, those are shotgun shells that light shit on fire. I don't know that we can actually get into any of these other barrels, though. They do look kind of cracked, some of them. I guess we could try a dynamite on one of these. Nope. Well, whatever, that's fine. Let's just move on here. Get back in here. Lock the door. Need a key. We need the gold key. And where did he go after that? I don't know. He's dis he's disappeared. So there's definitely like a whole section over here. Okay, so that opens that. That won't open. Is there anything in there? Won't budge. Yes, kind of. We're going to have to figure out a way to get in there, I guess, is our goal. Because otherwise, we're not going to be able to open... Yeah, there's another door behind it. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to open this thing all the way up. So, fair enough there. Let's cruise on down this way, I guess. Okay, that guy was either just alive or something, because there's, I don't know, traps, you say. Ow. <laughs> I mean, I, I suspected something was going to happen there, but at the same time, come on. Okay, so we got, ooh, well, did we get the bullets or not? There we go. I see, there's a plate. I see. 
right there. Um, maybe if we just do this. And thread the needle, <laughs> it won't matter. I guess that kind of worked. What do we got down here? This looks like spooky, scary, spooky skeleton town all over again, <laughs> which I hate. No? No skeletons going to be upset about me? Uh-oh. Oh, yep, okay. I see I see how it is. Let's try this way. Seems like I may have actually accidented myself upon where I need to go. Unless this is just another uh, opportunity to grab like the last item we need. Because it does seem kind of like we're going back toward above ground area. I guess I'll use that health pack now. Oh, hello there. My mistake. Why would I ever want to be able to be left in peace long enough to heal for a sec? So is this where I just came in? I am... Very lost at this point. <laughs> no idea where the hell I'm supposed to go. This doesn't look that... I mean, it looks kind of samey, but... I don't think it's the same spot. Yeah, this is different. Got some shotgun shells. I guess we can switch to that for a sec here. And let's just... Jeremiah? No, you're an interloper! <laughs> okay, I'm an interloper, I guess. Sure. Can't argue with the, uh... the facts here, really. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Uh, what are we going to do here? These phosphor shells might come in handy. Um, aside from that, this might be a situation where it's time for some silver bullets. Won't budge. Jammed. Okay. Can't see shit in these corners. Okay, need a key for that. Stuck. There might not be much we can do here at the moment. Jammed. Yeah, because we got some ammunition there, but all these other doors are uh, locked at the moment. So I guess we got to go back. Oh my God, where am I going? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Go back this way. But don't go there. We're going to go up here. And uh, then I guess back down here. Back to Spooky Skeleton Town. And uh, now we just run for our lives forever. And ever and ever. Almost looks like something I could interact with there. Um, hmm. 
I think I'm going back the way that we originally came into this area. If we go up there... What's this? Jammed. No, okay. Yeah, no, maybe we came in here. It's, it's really hard to say. Okay, well, there's HP this way. Not that it's going to actually save me. <laughs> um... Yeah, I feel like I'm going in circles right now. Probably because I literally am going in circles right now. Try... No, okay, so I've definitely been there before. I mean, maybe we could fight all these skeletons and uh, kill them, but... With the way things have been going, it just seems so unlikely. And that's that just brings me brings brings me back to here. Okay, well, I um I don't know what I'm gonna do about this. Uh I think reload the game so we don't waste uh our health here. Uh yeah, when we come back, I guess I don't know, maybe I'll have to just take a look around off screen downstairs there. Cause it, it's clear we're missing at least two keys right now. Um so uh, yeah, that's gonna take a little, little bit of thought, especially with enemies that seem to respawn indefinitely at this point, uh, in a lot of places, so, yeah, I don't know, I guess we'll, we'll just, uh, figure it out for, uh, for next time.